wanna spend my life with you all day You say that you love me, is it true? You say I'm the only one that's all for you Okay, make me feel away Make me feel away Shorty so damn dangerous Fuck me like I'm famous, yeah I've been so impatient So glad that you made it here yeah. Took my dick and faced it Shorty going crazy, yeah Thought that you was playing, yeah Saw me spray it everywhere She want me to take it, take it What you trying to do? Shorty said she Yo, 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 we back As you can see, we at a brand new spot Man, we got a special guest today Carter Vision, we only got to do it right because we got to do it big at the World Wild Film Academy. Let's get into it. Uh, Carter Vision, talk to us about how you got into the photography and the media and stuff like that. Um, honestly, for me, it was like, uh, it was just something I always kind of interested in, in like high school and things like that. Um, I was kind of like nervous to like speak out about it. I was playing basketball at the time, so um, it was something I just worked towards and gradually like, you know, just, just really tried my hand with it. Somebody gave me like, a free camera, nice shot Kyle. He was like the first person to put like a camera in my hand. Nice. Yeah, and the first two people, I took a picture of my two cousins back there, Dante and Dre. They were like the first two people that, first two people that actually like, um, you know, they was open to like, yo, just take my picture, I'll post it, just showing love, just giving me that confidence, to, like, you know, keep going. Mm -hmm. I didn't have nobody really like, know who I was, or what I can bring to the what I can do. So that just was something like, just trying it out. Saying, what high school did you go to? Oh, the Lake Clifton. That, okay. Yeah, yeah. yeah. No, that's what's up. Got people with the Lake. Lake just won the state championship. Uh, yeah, it won. It won my senior year too. Oh, for real? Yeah. So you grew up with, like with Josh Selby and all them, like all them. Uh, I know Josh, but he was like way older. older than I graduated like 2019, so. He was oh yeah. yeah, I could have sworn I thought you were definitely older than that. <laughs> um. <laughs> Got you. So then, did, did they have, did Lake Clifton have like a arts program or anything of that sort? This was like uh, self directed. We had like an art class, but this is something that I wanted to do. Like you on your different. own. Like everybody that went to my school was either basketball, basketball, Southern Jewish, stuff like that. I was always like different, but I was, I was, the, I was the kid that was different, like as far as the music I listened to. Just, I had my own vibe of people. We can cuss on it or not? Yeah. <laughs> because when people fuck with me, like I, I, I had my own vibe, and it was just me, like me and my cousin, like Tay, like we always had like our own vibe as far as like how we carry shit and what we wanna do. Like we listen to more here and be like, yo, this is vibe. Yeah, like, yeah. Just shit like that that was just different. But where we come from is like, damn, it was like, what you, you supposed to listen to Baltimore music? I was always like, nah, I'm on my own vibe, and people always fuck with my own vibe. So. But why do you feel like you were nervous to like share your creativity and share like your work? Because I was hooping, so it was like you know usually yeah. when you just hop in another lane that's, that's just like abstract like that. People look at you like yeah. that. Like, Especially you, in Baltimore. Yeah, yeah like when you start taking pictures, like, I had a, I ain't trying to talk about no exes or nothing like that, but I had girls I was dealing with looking at me like laughing like, like trying to take pictures. From me. <laughs> that's that's how it is in Baltimore. Like when you deviate from like what they think the common path yeah, yeah. is, like. Niggas will really try to downplay like, your was, craft. Like, like which, look at you with your little camera. Yeah, like, I was, like, sad. Cause I'm like, damn, like, I ain't probably gonna make it to the league. I'm not probably gonna make it to college basketball. But I was like, all right, let me switch it. Let me switch the floor. Let me just yeah. do it myself. And I always had that mindset. Like, all right, you, you, you sound like this shit corny now. Wait, like, two years from now, let's see, let's see where they're getting. Now I'm gonna build for it and shit. So it's like, exactly. they post it. So it's like, yeah, I don't really matter what people or girls think. Just. So them girlies be hitting you up now? I'm sure. <laughs> I don't know. Man. <laughs> I'm sure they be like, oh, I'm sorry. I don't know. Like, like, I know. <laughs> Literally. So, so like, did you find that you were passionate about this? Like when you were like, yeah, honestly, like teeny bopper, yeah, yeah, or did it grow? Honestly, <laughs> it makes sense. Cause like, in my grandma, I was right. Like me and my grandma, we used to always like sleep on the floor. Like she had like a mm. floor in her, uh, in her house with a TV. My cousin Dre probably seen it. She had like hella VCR TV. Mm. So I used to like sneak, she used to like sew in the basement in our house on Robinson Street. She used to sew in the basement. I used to be like in the top floor, like the, the living room, just watching VCR tapes. Shit that I ain't supposed to be watching, like Chef. Um, yeah. I'm gonna get you sucker. House party. That's house classic. Party. <laughs> Friday. Yes. She used to be like, cut that off, all that custom on it. But at the time, I'm like probably six, seven, eight, and I'm looking at all these different films, like from. Just it's, it's art, poetic. Yeah, like, um, 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 what's what's our movie called? Love Jones. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. oh, that's classic too. Like, yeah. You know, at the time, I'm not really saying it. Like, I'm not really saying it as 
it's like, why well, I'm really like taking it all this up. I'm just looking at it like, oh, these movies dope to me. Dope, you know, yeah. So I'm like getting an artsy mindset at an early age, but it just come from watching VCR, so all these movies. Yeah. Like, so it kind of made sense to do it. I'm kind of connected. Uh, yeah, that's dope, man. Like, so what grade did you actually start? Or what, like, you was like, all right, yo, this time I got to take this, take this shift to, to get into this full time with you? Um, it was when I quit my job at DTLR. Um, I got my first job at gotcha. DTLR at a prep school, and I started working there. What prep school you went to? Mount Zion. Mount Zion, mm-hmm. out in North Carolina? No, nah, it was in uh, D.C. In D.C.? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's, like, yeah. it's like three of them, so I don't know. Cause I'm a hooper, too, so I'll hoop out and yeah. all that, too. So. Yeah, I went to Mount Zion, man, and, and it's so crazy because like, I had a cousin. I was still doing like little stuff, like little parties for the kid named um, Taiwan and Taiwan Cops. Mm-hmm. Like, parties mm-hmm. in Baltimore. I don't know if I feel like I've heard of it. Yeah, I, definitely yeah, I used to do this party. So my cousin, I was going to school in DC. This is my first first start. I was getting paid like ninety dollars for this party to just take pictures. I didn't really know what I was doing, but yeah. he would pick me up in a broken down Atwood, Meach, my big cousin Meach, mm-hmm. picked me up in a broken down Atwood, all the way from Columbia, drive all the way to DC, come get me, take me all the way to Baltimore, Woodlawn, just to do like a party. So mm. that was like you know the, the start of like. Shout right, out to him. Yeah, 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 like, like that's <laughs> crazy. He's like, like he ain't really know I was gonna pop. None, yeah. of, my, none of my real close friends knew I was really gonna pop. I yeah. all three of my cousins. It was just something for you just make some make some side money while you swooping. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And honestly, I, I knew like I was gonna take it serious. Like once I got that detail love job, he taught me any type of way. Mm-hmm. Like my cousin, man, and my cousin, we worked together at detail love. So he know like we was he taught us any kind of way, clean the bathroom, do this, do that. I'm 19, so I'm like, this shit ain't for me, right. man. Like, yeah. I ain't, I'm like, I gotta go harder, so. I took it, I took it personal after a while. Like you know, it, if if I really want this to work, I'm really at sacrifice certain things and just sacrifice some fun. Yeah. Can't buy the nicest clothes. Like I'm locked mm-hmm. in on like what I really want. Cause I saw what was ahead, not just mm-hmm. the short term. I saw the long term for my vision, not yeah. nobody else. Shit. So, in school, I even in that, like I dropped out of school for this shit. Like it was a, it was personal for me. Like I knew I was gonna make it. So. But that's how it be. I feel like when you see your vision, like. When people, you know, tell you like, "Oh, go watch this, do that," you like, you looking at yourself and you looking at them like, "That ain't even me." Yeah, like, not even, not even that. It was the people that was telling me that they older that than too, me, like yeah. 27, 28. Yeah. yeah, they got like little, they got maybe if they even couple graduated down. from school. Couple like, down. They projecting. That's all they. Yeah, yeah they got, literally like, they looking at me, and I don't want to be in that type of energy, man. They mm-hmm. looking at me like, "Damn, he really young." I don't, I don't want to get manipulated. Cause yeah. it's easy to get manipulated in that type of situation. Yeah, yeah. Like, he looking at you like, yeah, let the me barrel, manipulate man. him and make him feel less of himself because I'm his boss. Whole time, your life not even, I'm still young. I could yeah. quit and be cool. Cool, yeah. yeah. You have to like finish now. You really the manager of his. So right. like, I had that mindset like, nah, fuck that. You ain't really manipulate me. Like, yeah. um, I quit. I bet on myself. Like, I was like, man, it's about that time. Like, Whatever happened, happened. Yeah. Yeah. So at what point did it finally like? Okay, you you locked in. I was about to make a TikTok reference. Oh Jesus! <laughs> but you finally locked in, and then at what point did it really start to pick up for you? And he was like, oh, like I'm seeing a difference now. It was like I ain't gonna lie. Like the person I was dealing with, 2020 man. Um, she definitely motivated me a lot to like mm, hire know, my shout friends. Out. Definitely right, me look at me. Like, oh, right. it me like shout out to everybody push, who helped push, me. Push myself like in, in like the right direction. Like you'll get a new camera. Um, you know this is what you. And this is like around quarantine. So you know quarantine it was like 2020. So it's mm. like a lot of time for me to like really develop my skill right. and craft. Mm-hmm. And I would say that summer, man, I, I took a super leap and I started like traveling, going to Atlanta, doing different things in different places. And it took me that whole summer, and by the summertime, it's like, I'm hot. Then the wintertime, it's like, all right, now I'm really getting these people's attention. Mm-hmm. By the beginning of 2021, when I get signed, I'm like, damn, that shit yeah, quick. quick. It was like an ultimate focus. Like, and, and you know, I thank all the people that helped me along the way, just keeping me locked in towards you know, my, my, my overall goal, yeah. what, I was, what I was trying to really do. So, so give, me a, give me a story, because you said you traveling like, to Atlanta and all that stuff. Give me like a story of how... Yeah. You're getting it, cause I know you. I mean, you had to find the time, like get a uh, bus, get a okay, car. Okay, man, yeah. it's like a true story, bro. I I, uh, I had to do this Atlanta recap weekend, right? For mm. the, the kid named Ron Uncut. He owned a couple restaurants and shit. I did a, a weekend for him in Atlanta, and I'm just thinking it's a cool weekend, get a couple couple dollars. Yeah, yeah. Bar, bar. it's Atlanta though. I'm at Compound Meat Walking. I'm like, See? Fuck. I'm like, <laughs> That's what I was talking about earlier. Yeah. Really? Yeah. Like, 
that's like my favorite rapper. So he walked in, I'm like, alright, it's time to make a video. Like, it's time to go yeah, now. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Opportunity. So that's a suck. I locked in with it. I did the, I did the, uh, I did the, I did the shoot, man. He, he wound up posting like a week later. So I'm like, sent it to him. He like, yo, this kid hot. I'm like, that's love. I wound up, um, I wound up going to Atlanta again. I had to do this event for the uh, Larry Love. I don't know Larry Love, yeah. 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 yeah, yeah. Come on, to come on the show soon. Yeah, I did a, I did a, um, I had to do an event for him. He booked me to come to Atlanta. So it just so happened. Me had another thing. This one Bobby Schmurry came home. So uh, at this time, see, we, look yeah, at by the guys. first time, yeah, so by the first time, he started following me. So I'm like, all right, he told me to pull up. So I'm like, all right, bet. But at the time, ain't, I don't got his number yet. So I'm like, how the fuck am I going to pull up? Like, yeah. I'm, you feel me? Like, yeah. my, my license wasn't even flipped to high school. Oh, dang. <laughs> I just turned 21. So for me to get in the club, my license had to be Flip, flip, yeah. yeah. My, my shit wasn't flipped yet, so security tripping. He like, no, you can't get in. So I'm like, fuck. This me personally told me, yo, come pull, pull up. He's like disrespecting me. Don't even show up. Yeah, like that. Tell you come. So security turned his head, and I jumped the gate. My book bag going around. Oh, that's right. Look, that's that Lord of the Rings. It's dark, dark and compound too. So <laughs> I'm like, so in my mind, thing like, should I go back to the hotel, edit Larry shit, or should I just bet on myself and do this shit? So it was like one of those decisions where like. And I ain't telling people do no shit like that. You, know, <laughs> you, you get locked up or some shit. But I'm saying, make the right decision at the right time where you feel like you should like try you this shit. Yeah, it's, literally, it's, it's like, like a, like a, like a <laughs> over super, the gate. Like one second, like yeah. this shit like this, yeah. this shit can it just, happen it just, or this shit can't. It just, it just hit you. You just had. Yeah, you I was like, it. and at the time, I'm like, what the fuck can I lose? Yeah. Real shit, real shit. Like, yeah. what can I lose? I'm like, fuck it. Mm -hmm. I jump the gate. While I'm getting in, it's probably like ten. I ain't, ain't get there till like two. So I'm waiting from ten to two. Oh damn! Just oh, getting so celebrities don't show up. Yeah. I'm, like, I'm bored at that point, so I'm getting sleepy. <laughs> Next thing I know, it was in a motherfucking section and shit. He's like, uh, "Who can manage you?" And I'm like, "Damn!" You know what I mean? Like, he just, he you just, just told me pull up. Yeah, he just told me pull up. But then he looked at me for real. He ain't really. He just alert. He ain't really. Know. I'm like, I'm calling his vision. Like, oh, you Yeah, I would hope she to this day if she sees us, I hope she understands. Like, it's still no bad blood. But I had to make the decision on the best of me at the time. Um, he said, pull up. So I told her, like, yo, I got to meet him at the jet spot. Like, I'm uh -huh. sorry. Like, uh, all yeah. respect. Like, I'll give you your money back, whatever case may be. And I'm at me at the jet spot. Was with him the whole day. Did the whole video for him. Gave it to him, like, the next day. I don't even think I, I went to sleep that night. Like, at all. Like, I was dirty. Had out on the dirt bike. Held my legs. So I on. All dirty, baby blue, too. Yeah. yeah it's fucked up. Yeah, he fucked with that, and and it was easy for him to like click with me because it was like the whole time 
uh, first night I was in the studio, the only thing I even put my camera down, like, it was to the point where he had to tell me, like, Carl, you can put it down, like, it's cool. <laughs> but that's the type of shit that, that you gotta really be on at that level to even, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, and it was to the point where I had it up, he looked my way, and I'm thinking, like, mm-hmm. all right, he want me to record. I was like, he's like, nah, you good? And he was like, yo, I really like you, yo. I like you. <laughs> and I was like, I was like, yeah, this shit probably gonna be cool. And from there, I went back home at the Lemon Pepper, and um, he basically told me, like, nah, bro, you gotta stay. So in the time I'm staying, I ain't getting paid, I ain't doing nothing. I'm just like, working. Like, but mm-hmm. I ain't mine, cause it's like, shit, yeah. it's like, it's, it's networking. Like, yeah, you building your portfolio, life, your yeah, yeah, resume, yeah, all that. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Bahamas with him, and that was the first time, man. It was like, damn, like, I'm eating dinner with Diddy. Uh, who else? Uh, French. Mm-hmm. Uh, it was a lot of people there, man, but I was just taking it in. I, 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 he put me like, like, it was just so much, man. He did he did so much so quick, man. Like, just telling Hove about me, Jigga, like, just on some, like, whole yeah. lot of stuff. Mm-hmm. That's like, dope. Man, like, that's really love. Yeah. Like, and I love him for that, so, you know, it's definitely love to just give somebody opportunity to show them had to give them an opportunity yeah. to, like, I ain't had no real name before you, like, really put me on. Yeah. And that's a, that's a, a smooth lesson for everybody, like, yo, you don't even gotta, like, take the money, you just gotta take the network and take yeah. the relationship. Yeah, time, yeah, relationship. At the time, I'm living in New York, mind you. I don't really like, I'm really losing money at the time. You get what I'm saying? Because you're not getting paid yeah, today. Yeah, yeah, yeah. to fund your regular standing, life. I'm standing like a, a, a hotel, um, a hotel I'm standing, man. It, it was, like, I think my cousin came to me one time. It really wasn't the best of the best, the but best. it was like, shit, yeah. I don't care. I'm not here. Like, it, I'm, I'm working. Like, yeah, I really yeah. trip him on the hotel. Like, the fact that he even was kind enough to put me in something like that when I'm living in New York is love in itself. Right? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, 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 you built a relationship. You wasn't really, yeah. yeah. Anything you better than Baltimore. Yeah. Anything. Yeah. Like, I'm living in yeah. New York for free. Yeah, so it's cool. Like, and you, like I said, you around all them people. That's, that's just building your, like I said, building your portfolio and all. Yeah, all you're gonna definitely. do is shopping your craft anyway. Mm-hmm. Cause I know the bag came later on, so. Yeah, for sure. Exactly. Yeah, so shoot. Sure. I mean, yeah. I think it all paid off. Yeah, exactly. I ain't gonna talk with too much on camera, but. Oh yeah, no. Yeah, I, but I, 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 I definitely, I yeah. definitely feel like being from Baltimore, like you know. I don't want to say like we all come from humble beginnings, but we do. So like, yeah. you know, when we get the opportunity, like that's the one thing I love about us and like seeing like your yeah. path, like you just you hopped yeah. on it, like and, you saw it. And, and even that, like he could have got like a, I'm gonna be real, he could have got like a white boy that went to school for exactly. Or, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Who you know what I'm saying? Somebody, graduated yeah, with a degree. Really and, it. Oh, he said, "I'm gonna fuck with this kid from East Baltimore. That's humble. Right your work. Like I ain't had no chip on my shoulder. Mm-hmm. Like, I ain't humble. Like you know, I always been like that." I always like a super hard worker for, for whoever I did work for. I always try my best to, you know, get that shit to him the next day or, you know what I'm saying? And it was tough for me, man. Like, I, I was away from so much for so long. I mm-hmm. moved there. I moved there with him in, like, April, I think. So, you got to think, in the time of April, when I moved with him in New York, I'm missing my friend's birthdays. I'm missing mm-hmm. my mom, mother's yeah. day. Like, you know, it's, that shit that's getting to me. Mm-hmm. I ain't speaking on it, but that shit hurt me. Yeah. I ain't, yeah. It's hard for me to really articulate that, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, I ain't really talk to my friends as much, and it's like, that, all that shit was hurting me, because I'm used to being with them every day, every mm-hmm. day. Yeah. my friends, family. And you graduated high school 2019, right? Yeah, prep school. Pre- well, prep school, gotcha. Yeah, you. still high school for yeah. Basically, so, basically. So, 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 all that shit was, like, new to me, because yeah. like, I'm around, like, adults all day. Yeah, you know, I'm around, these are, like, my big brothers, but sometimes it's cool to just be around people. Yeah, like, 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 your age, age, know what you, yeah. like, been around. Yeah. Like, what you been, it's, about, like, early like, 20s, like. They talk about, like, about man all of and shit, I'm like, yo. But but do you feel like that helped you? Because I know they said that you should never be like the smartest in the room. So do you feel like being around all of those people like that really helped you? I feel like I'm so advanced, man. So many different subjects as far as like women, uh, uh, women for sure. Um, (laughs) Money, money, like investing my money in different Mm -hmm. things. That's that's important. Yeah, Yeah. um, just different things, man. Like I I feel like I could have splurged. Like I feel like the older me, like back when I was like probably 19, 20, 21. Like my cousin probably tell you, the older me probably would have been with like a bust down watch or like a Cuban chain, just off some impulsive shit. But uh-huh. now I'm more like alert on, you know, what matters, like, and you know, the things that I really need versus like what I don't need. Mm-hmm. Right now. So I'm 22. By the time I get like 25, I think I might really pop out. But 
Yeah, you be sick yeah, by time. Listen, yeah, you got time, yo. So that, I think yeah. the plan for right now, I just want to keep building a bridge to help my family and, you know, my friends and mm-hmm. really put them in positions to, like, really accommodate their dreams and their goals and make this, like, a whole corporation. Because at the end of the yeah. day, it ain't just for me, it's for all the people I love and people that sacrifice. Yeah. Them, yeah. Them, them, the, them the people I'm really thinking about most of them myself because I feel like when you think about just yourself, like, Dang, it don't. Y'all want to make sure everybody eat. Yeah, when you make it out, you want to bring people that you love with you. Yeah, but also people that deserve to be there too. Yeah. Like I ain't, I ain't sweet. Don't take me wrong. Like, I know when, <laughs> I know when people using me, and I know when people like really mm. like love me and they really want to put the work in. So Facts. if you think you use me, like that's just like false. Mm-hmm. Like, yeah. You're smart. Speaking of smart, we are all smart people here. I love this conversation, and we'll be right back to continue it after this break. Okay. 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 Gotta get it. Uh, niggas out here hatin', but ain't stoppin' shit. Uh, stop procrastinating, wasting time and shit. Uh, niggas only gangsta when they signin' in. Uh, hold on, baby, I can't hold on. Uh, so long, baby, I can't go on. Uh, so long, damn, I did you so long. Yeah, let's talk about Rock Nation and Dream Chase. Let's talk a little, a little bit more about that. Um, so last time I deal with me, but uh, Dream Chase probably, I would say, I ain't much. I probably said I, it took me until like June or something like that. So I finally, I finally closed in like June. So it was like a, a collaboration with Dream Chaser and Rock Nation. So I basically do work with like both parties. So I signed like a cool deal for um, a certain amount of time. And now, man, with me and me working on it now, like, I don't know if you guys watch like Kanye documentary. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Cooley got like 30 million for that. So right now, uh, with me, wants to do is kind of like, same the same vibe. Yeah, not yeah, definitely that. But it's more so like on the ownership side, he's looking to looking to buy like a piece of like you know my company and like what I what I what I aim for oh, so right cool. now. Gotcha. Yeah, it's right now it's just like you know working with that, the whole production, and you know trying to build something as far as like with, with Dream Chase production and making it to something like super special instead of you know what I'm saying. It's a big process. You know, yeah, yeah, no, yeah, definitely something I I, I can't really. Really can't speak on all the way, but yeah. It's definitely like a cool move for me and for my family, so yeah, definitely like, something a couple years down the line. Yeah, like, like, like both of y'all like collaborating on, on your own production company, pretty much. Yeah, so, so, yeah, so it's like, yeah, you, you running it, and mm-hmm. then he just helped yeah. him, he, he helped co sign. Instead of, you know what I'm saying, people just always, I guess, you know, um, just, I guess, winning off of his, his name and just moving exactly. on, exactly. You know Why mm-hmm. not just stick together and just build yeah. something that, like. Like right. I've seen before, and, and, that's, and that's something I would love to do with, do with him. Like, out of any artist, I feel like, you know, me doing something with Dream Chase is like a, a dream for me because, you know, he probably like one of the realest artists that, that I really came into. And I, I, I've i been in rooms with multiple artists like, mm-hmm. a lot of times, so mm-hmm. I, know, I know how it is with different artists and how they treat the cameraman or just how they act in general. Mm-hmm. He, yeah. he, like, uh, he, he probably one of the most, the, the, the most in reality artists that, that, I've, that I've ever met where it's like he really still in tune with, with reality. Mm-hmm. And that's the shit that like, you know, make me appreciate him 10 times more because yeah. like, hey, he don't really let that shit get to right. him. And that's why I like, you know, whenever I come home, I still stop at my grandma's house. I still <laughs> do regular shit because yeah. like, I ain't no bigger than anybody else. Yeah. Like, you know, if I could, I would reach out to all my friends. I can't do that, but if I could, I would, you know yeah. what I'm saying? So it's yeah. like, I just see him and the way he still treat people and the way he, you know, carry certain things like a lot of artists they, they just stuck in like a metaverse type world like, they just shot off <laughs> yeah literally like, the they metaverse just, they just shot off like he's still in touch like and he is a very powerful person so you know he, he's still in touch with, with the real world and what's really going on and that shit is like worth more than any type of money yeah they always say like Baltimore and Philly like cousins. yeah I was literally about yeah. to say they say that, like, like cuss old love. the fact that he always take like people from Baltimore and bring them with him like he like so you feel me? So it's like he always showed that Baltimore connection love. So yeah, it's like, like he, he he did things for me, bro. That's like sometimes I even still look at it like damn. Like I remember the first time I ever was in like room with Jay Z. Like I come in the room, I see Jay. That's my first time really seeing him in person. He know who I am, but yeah. my first time seeing him in person. So I walk in the studio like a Saturday. Walk in the studio, man. Um, you know I see him, so I'm like, alright, play it cool, like you know what I'm saying. Uh-huh. Walk up to him, he said, Carter, what's up? So I'm like, all right, back, like, all right, this is me. Yeah, 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 like, all right, I'm good. I see Jay right here, man. He gave me like a little, uh, he gave me like a pound. But at the time, I don't really, he know who Carter's vision is, but who Carter's vision is, they don't really know my 
face at the time. Right. So he gave me like one of these for real, for real. Yeah. Probably like five minutes later, uh, Meek was like, yeah, Carter, show him some of the vids. He was like, oh, this Carter's living right here. He gave me one of these, look. <laughs> <laughs> Pictures from too, like he just sat and we all like circled around looking on my iPad at the video. He like looking at it, he like, Oh, this shit is dope, you killing shit. That alone right there gave me like the validation. Like, that, like, yeah. 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 like, this shit is like way past like Baltimore. It's like, you know, it's bigger, way bigger than that. And just the fact that me even really be sending him my shit all the time is like more like, you know, it's, it's, yeah. it's, it's amazing too. So, you know, after that, man, G had like a, 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 a very good relationship, like dinners with him, just. Just chopping it up. Chopping yeah. it up. Just yeah. different things, you know what I'm saying? Like not even talking about business, probably I just probably just talking about yeah, life. Just shit sometimes like I don't even really want to talk, <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. Like realistically, I don't want to talk. Drop the game like, on you. Yeah, I don't really wanna talk. And, and, and honestly it ain't really my place to talk at this level that I'm at right now. Like I feel like it's cool to just listen, listen to what he's saying. Sometimes it'll be like a lot of big boy shit, so <laughs> that ain't even really shit for me to talk about anyway. <laughs> right. But you know, in all reality, man, I just be trying to soak everything in and you know as much as I can, like whenever I'm in his office with him and stuff. Like yeah. I remember one time when the album dropped, I called my cousin. I was in, um, called, I called my cousin Tay. I'm on FaceTime with him trying to sneak and show him the office, <laughs> trying to show him what it looked like and shit. And, and, and that right there, man, is the shit that like, you know, just so, so my people can see the motivation too. Like, oh, this really where we took this shit from, taking pictures mm -hmm. of my steps. Now I'm in mean, like, jiggle office. Like, that mm -hmm. shit right there is like crazy. Yeah, that's crazy. Yeah, like, even me and me, like we took a picture on a jiggle couch. And, I think like the same day he dropped his album, he posted me like Carter put on for watch and all like shit like that. That's the shit that like motivated me to be like, yo, you really did some special shit. Like, yeah. Some crazy shit too. Like, it should happen. That's what's That's up. What That's what's up. I, I feel like we already know the answer to this question, but I just have to ask it just because it's one of the questions. So, do you feel like you like made it to a degree? You get what I'm saying? Like, I feel like we uh, know how you feel, like, but feel just like, to I put it out like, there. I feel like I'm on my stage where like I got to this point, but this is just like the this is just like the bread, man, of mm -hmm. the bread and the butter, like where I really wanna take this shit. I feel like I ain't really reached my maximum, like my, my altitude. Like I'm 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 Not just getting all. my foot in the door. I got my I was lucky enough to get my foot foot in the door at twenty one, get a feel of how the industry is, how mm -hmm. how it works and what not to do, what to do. So mm -hmm. now it's like I'm comfortable now, like, you know. I got a little bit of, I got some shit on my belt. So yeah. now it's like, all right, now let me take it to this level. Like, let me yep. show y'all. Like, you know, and, it, and and then my whole life, man, it was it was always levels. So no, I don't feel like I made it, but my whole life, I always looked at it as levels. 2019, mm -hmm. I'm starting the car's vision. Let me get my feet better. Let me get Baltimore on my side. 2020, all right, I got Baltimore. Now mm -hmm. it's like, you know what I'm saying? Let me, take over the let world me, now. Let me take over, you know, let me go to the ATL. Let me see how that is. And from there, all right, we took over that. Now it's like, all right, me fuck with me. All right, now let's do some, some whole other shit. Let's do some wherever I shit. Now mm -hmm. I'm keeping on me all over, but I want to take it even further. Like, I want to do some, like, some, some, some crazy shit. Like, I, I want to, like, take over the world, bro. It mm -hmm. sounds crazy right now. It right? don't. Well, it, it don't sound. You I'm sure it don't sound crazy to us. You don't but sound I, crazy. But I, but I promise you, listen, right? It, it, and my cousin can attest to this. Both of my cousins. Like, I was saying this shit back in 2019, like, 2020. I was telling them this shit. Like, yo, I'm going to be the it's like I'm telling them this like every day, like, yo, like. I see them nodding. Yeah, like, for real, for real, like, they yeah. tell you, like, and for me to be so adamant about hooping and then just switching it. Switch it like that. Like, yo, yeah. man, you do that shit, they probably looking at it like, yeah, you're going to be cool, but they ain't know it was going to get to this extent. Mm -hmm. So now it's like, all right, I'm back with the blueprint. Like, all right, they saying I can't do this now. All right, give me like mm -hmm. two more years. You're going to see me on Netflix, yeah. 30 million, 40 exactly. million yeah. looking at this. Exactly. Like, like, it's that serious. So how does it feel to like basically live your life in confidentiality all the time? I know like I work I, about it, So like I know I work for I've worked for like a lot of big brands and you work on things that like months and years and a lot that you can't talk about but you have to yeah. kind of like live your everyday life. Yeah. Like how does that feel to go from like oh I'm just a normal person to like oh yeah, I mean I'm living my life but I know in like 6 months or a year from now yeah. all these big projects are coming along. That shit really don't bother me. I take it I take it with a grain of salt and I and I use that time, man. Like, I'm learning right now to really use that time to evaluate the people around me. Fact. And what I mean by that is that sometimes, like, when shit slow down, you see, like, like I feel like when shit was hot, this last summer for real, 2021, like, that whole summer, shit was hot. There was so many people coming to me, like, from 
around me yeah. that really wasn't really necessarily like never really around. So it was yeah. like shit slowed down a little bit. It's like uh, you see like I'm right, batting away a little bit. You ain't really doing as much. You ain't really trying to collaborate right. or help me as much. And I see all that shit, bro. Yeah. And it's like I know what I got in store. I know what's coming. So you can you know not try to help me with this and not try to help me with that. The people that mm-hmm. really is. A lot then fully like I, I be saying that shit like my my, my homegirl wisdom like she she locked shit down she locked shit down for for years and me like she don't want nothing in return but that's one of the people who like do do thick do thin like she gonna just you know them the type of people that I pay attention yeah. to stuff, like yo that's real love like you know what I'm saying she know this shit a little slow right now like I ain't really dropping nothing but she know like my well, shit gonna be up in a couple uh-huh. months like yeah like man me got like probably six seven eight videos unreleased like mm. five so be, like brand stuff they yeah. be sitting on projects yeah. for yeah. a long time yeah. man, uh, man uzi tiara whack fabulous mm-hmm. um mm-hmm. who else who else i did some shit with um alicia keys oh, that's, uh, that's why you were talking about it earlier yeah yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah. that's what's up all right, all right. real shit, shit shit that's like a podcast like this with a uh, lonzo ball like uh-huh. mm-hmm. yeah like yeah. some, some high level stuff that, that, that even corporate stuff. So it's like, you know, definitely high level stuff, but everything in this industry take a little bit of patience. Uh, mm-hmm. more crime. I'm still learning the industry in the business side, but, you know, I definitely want to chat with all levels. Yeah. It's, it's, it's interesting you say that because that's what I was about to go into next. Like, knowing who, who really with you, who really ride with you, who, who like, now nah, I got to leave you alone. Like, yeah. it's kind of hard when you actually, let's get into the next one, like, the, the industry. Like, yeah, sure. It's it's hard because it's like when you in that when you in that uh, when you in that same energy where everybody everybody gonna I'm be showing. I'm, I'm gonna be real, bro. I feel like she can easily get like misconstrued. Like mm-hmm. sometimes when you're so busy and you so like then feelings get involved and Fact. you might feel some type of way. Your friends might feel some type of way. The whole time a conversation's gotta be held. Exactly. Like, instead of like you know what I'm saying. Like, it's easy for shit to get misconstrued. Whereas though, I might tell somebody some shit on how I'm feeling mm-hmm. and it come off like. Damn, like you really like talk shit, or he really whole time really just hurt. Like I miss my friend. Like yeah, on some real shit though. Like and it, and it can easily get get misconstrued like that. So uh, as far as like me, what, what's the question? Is is that the again you said as far as like people? Yeah, and in the industry like like who really fool you? you yeah, yeah, so who ain't really fool you? So, so as far as that, like I feel like I'm saying it so much more, man. And 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 honestly, it's like crazy to me because I know who really for me versus how much we go through mm-hmm. and, and, and saying like, if you still gonna be there, like, for instance, like me and my cousin, we probably had like a million arguments throughout our whole life, throughout, <laughs> literally, no bullshit, mm-hmm. like a million that's, arguments. That's their cousin mode. Yeah, like, like <laughs> yeah. Hey, hey, Gemini, I'm gonna say you're tired of Oh, yeah, y'all bump. Look, yeah. 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 I said it's hammer rest. Girl. Yeah. 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 all the time, but. But at the end of the day, man, it's like, you know, I slept on his couch before, he slept on my couch before, his mm-hmm. mom was doing anything for me, my mom was doing anything Yeah, the sandbox, so, I came up from the sandbox. Yeah, yeah, so so it's always going to be like that, that, that love, man, whatever. I'm fucking up, if he fucking up, we ain't perfect, shit, people go through shit, man. He holds you accountable. Yeah, you hold yeah, yeah. Accountable. 100% hold me accountable. Sometimes I can't take it, sometimes yeah, I can't take it, so yeah. we be needing all the time. But you need that, though. Yeah, hell yeah. He, he definitely, like, one of my brother's friends all, all together, I ain't know he's eye to eye, but. That's like a real friend. You know need need you that. You need that. On, like going on the way up, cause when you yeah. you, did, you get kind of shaky, you never yeah. know. And I feel yeah. like it did for me too. Like in the process of me, like I ain't gonna say that shit got in my head, but you do start to change the ways. Like mm-hmm. you know what I'm saying? Right. It, it, it can it can be different to people who saw this version of you before. Right. Back then. Yeah. But I feel like that's natural. Like yeah, you sure. going through so much change. Like you yeah. getting a little money oh, now. Right. You get around different people. Wrong, so yeah. Yeah. That's where that's where the disconnect. And it's a shift in mindset too. Exactly. That's where the disconnect could come at. Like. And he changed, and I don't know who he is whole time. It's not that. It's just I'm around different shit. Yeah. Exactly. It's not the fact that I'm changing. It's just, you know, people it's, go I mean, you shit, just like, said, too, like, you be around people talking about million-dollar deals and yeah, stuff like that. So you got to change your mindset yeah, from, like, you know, yeah, your everyday. I'm running shit every day. And, and, like, and, you know, and at the same time, like, you still learning. Like, you yeah. ain't, you ain't, and, you ain't, and you and ain't perfect. That part about it is what I learned, too. Like, everything you do is easily, like, it's, um, like, I could spaz on y'all right now, and y'all could be like, yo, Connor's bitch, like, <laughs> right? I could just be having a bad day. Yeah. But, y'all, but anybody on the outside looking in, they looking like, he really an asshole. Yeah. Old time just had one bad day. And yeah. it's like, everything you do is easily getting like, uh, what's that shit called? Like, um, misconstrued. Misconstrued, or just you just get judged. Like, yeah, yeah, all that. Like, yeah. You're just getting an extra nah. judgment, yeah, of, uh, like yeah. amongst from yeah. us. Like we like, average. Like, you know? yeah, I'm gonna give a true story. I went to um, ball one of my beat it. I had like a bad day. I wasn't feeling it. It was like a day at my birthday and shit. Mm-hmm. They took me out to eat, 
and I spazzed on like the owner and shit. That was like a bad day. <laughs> mm-hmm. I had a bad day. Like yeah. that's not who I am as a person. That's not. That's not who I am. You human. Yo. I'm human. Yeah. I, like, exactly. I have a bad day. Like you yeah. know, what I'm, saying? I'm not an asshole to anybody. I feel like I treat everybody with love and respect. Yeah. Anybody I run into. So. And I feel like when you got the spotlight. And you in front of that camera, everybody holds you some sort of a type a whole pedestal. Yeah, like, like, yeah when like, it's like when it's like yo, you, you yeah, like, uh, like you, 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 you the twenty, we, we the same, yeah, we put on the same so, shoes. So you, you. So now I got that, I got that kind of that 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 he's arrogant, he's um an asshole, he's like, I ain't even me, bro. Mm-hmm. Like, but at the same time, everybody but at the same time, smoke. people don't realize like the mindset shift is also to protect my energy. Cause I can't yeah. allow and certain I, I, I shit to real. like so penetrate my mental. Mm-hmm. Somebody said, "But the best." I felt disrespected. I felt yeah. like disrespected. Yeah. Me and my friends. I'm gonna be real. And to this day, I feel like that. I felt like you know they just. Disres- I had no bullshit. I had real billionaire white friends that own restaurants. Like, yeah. I don't have to be in here. I, I wanted to be in here, but the moment I felt disrespected, it's like, yo, like I'm a black young black kid. Like, if anything, bro, secondary opening, just a young fella. Man, just tighten up the mob, man. You know, yeah. you're welcome, welcome. You're more than welcome. Like, don't make me feel like I'm not really welcome. Like, yeah. I don't really have to be here, bro. And you don't know who I'm like. about to be you don't, you don't tomorrow. Even, you, don't like. know who, you don't even know who I already really <laughs> know for real. Yeah. Like, it's so fucked up. Like, two, probably two months before then, I'm with Robert Kraft. Like, Robert Kraft beat it, but who pushed? That's wow. Robert Kraft. Like, Damn. Hey. You know what I'm saying? I know, like, that's why like, I said, wow. They just dropped yeah. that all like, like it's not. So, so for me to say, like, oh, you don't even know who I am, that's what I, so, that's what I told the owner. I wasn't saying it like the negative no, way. I'm just, just saying, like, bro, like, I could be anybody. You treat me with disrespect, me and my friends. Yeah. Like, yeah. They easily got misconstrued as. You an asshole. And, here, asshole. and that's the thing, like, you're trying to block out now. Mm-hmm. Like, if I'm feeling some type of way, I'm going to keep that shit to myself, or I'm going to talk about that shit later. Like, yeah. you know what I'm saying? I'm just, it's, it, it's funny though when you say that because I didn't even get that from you. Like when, when, I, when we was talking earlier, even in, in like in the, in the, I know, in the I was I, even, like, even before that we was talking through the message and stuff like that. You was like, yeah, yeah I hit you with it about about doing this. You was like, yeah, just slide with my man. I talked yeah, talk to your manager, yeah. and you was like, yeah. So I slide. And we was trying, I was trying to get you on like maybe like a month and a half ago, but you was always doing your thing. Yeah. So I didn't really take that like it's like oh he just he yeah. just he trying to belittle us or whatever. He, he just busy. I mean I understand like this is. Yeah. It's something yeah. that got everybody scheduled. And I, mm-hmm. I I understand. Like some people won't take it as like yo. So I never really cu- came. It never came off as like yo. No, he just Hollywood. You mm-hmm. know what I'm saying? Yeah. I ain't like that. Yeah. yeah. So and it's, it's, it's and, peaks and, and, and that's the too, Like when I first started, man, I felt so. That's why I never asked nobody for help when I first started. And that's yeah. why I really in Baltimore. I really don't have a lot, like a lot of cameraman friends yeah. because I felt like I always tried to reach out to people, and it was like they gave me that mindset of like. Damn, you don't know how to do that? Yeah. No, nigga. Like, no, obviously. Like, yeah, no, like, like, what? I really don't know how to do that. Like, so everything <laughs> I did was always so tough because sometimes some cameraman for some reason got that mindset like you're supposed to know it. It's notice. a gatekeeping like, type of thing. Yeah, like, like, it's like some cameraman is weird. I'm going to be real. Yeah. I never was like that. I was always just me and the humble kids. So mm-hmm. I said, fuck, I'm going to learn this shit myself. So I don't really got too many cameraman friends like that. Uh, we got, yeah. a, we got, we got, we got like a similar story when it comes to like, like even when we started the podcast stuff, like we was reaching out, talking to people. Yeah. They was like, you don't know what you doing? Like I said, no, I'm yeah. learning on the fly. And that's why, like anybody, that's why I try to do that class, man. I want to do another one because mm-hmm. anybody that's really trying to learn or they just want free game, I talk. If you, if you homeless, like yeah. I'm talking to you. Like, yeah. I'm gonna lock yeah. in with you. Like, oh, that's what you need to do. This, this you need. Yeah. It take two seconds, like. I don't feel like you're that busy to where you can't reach out to somebody. Right. Yeah. Like, we just, like, I just made a quote about it up there. Yeah, like, like, sometimes I'm the type of person where you probably tell me some shit that's like some heavy shit. That shit might really help me. Like uh-huh. push me through. Like that don't need to hear that. Yeah. That might motivate me more than you just telling me how to fix the camera. Like right. you telling me some shit that's like. They don't, they don't, they don't understand it's the little things, man. It's just, yeah. it, t- it take you forever. Like but then they, you're always thinking like the big picture. Yeah, you feel me? So it's it's more than enough space and abundance for everybody to like yeah. eat and do what they gotta do. So Especially out here, like yeah. Baltimore, you just crab in the burrow, yo. They just yeah. they just take you like that. Yeah. yeah. But then it's like when you actually go out, when you leave, when you leave the city, mm-hmm. so much for you, yeah. so much, sure. so much for you, and you see how everybody's welcoming, yeah. how everybody can treat you like nah. That's why we always get that stigma like nah. Yeah. New York, man, I just ride my bike all day. Mm-hmm. Chill, ride, ride, go to the rock. 
Mm -hmm. I just be in my own world where I be at peace, man. It's, yeah. it's, 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 it's no partying, really, except when I'm with me. Mm -hmm. yeah. you know, when I'm in my own space in my free time, I just ride a bike. Listen to some yeah. music, get some food, relax. Yeah, that's like, that mental health right there. Yeah. I was literally about to say that. Like, that spending method? time with yourself, like, yeah. especially, like, when you begin to reflect on, like, your mindset, maybe your past traumas, yeah. whatever, you find compassion for yourself, and that's how you're able to, yeah. you know, show that to other people. Yeah, so, like, sure, when people right. take stuff personally, yeah. it's like, what? Yeah, like, yeah, how yeah, can yeah. you take what I'm going through personally, yeah, you know? Yeah. And, so. and honestly, man, to be honest, like, the, the whole 2021, I was going through, like, I was trying to find who I was, like, you, you gotta understand, like, I, I was, I ain't gonna say I'm by my, I ain't gonna say I was by myself, but in a sense, I kind of was, cause, mm -hmm. you know, even though I be with me, and I'm just like, at the end of the day, I am kind of by myself, yeah. like, you know what I'm saying, I don't have no friends or family mm -hmm. in New York, so it's like, I was trying to really figure out who, who has been, who is Carter, like, I'm trying to really figure that out, mm -hmm. so it's like, That's I'm going important. through my, my ups and downs, you know, trying to figure that out, you know, still having to take care of home, my dad, my mom, so, you know, mm -hmm. I'm, just, I'm trying to, like, really master who, who I am, and I was going through ups and downs with that, but I feel like, you know, coming to that, mm -hmm. that bridge where it's like, I'm understanding who I am and the type of people I want to yeah. around, nobody's proof that people going to fuck up, like, you know what I'm mm -hmm. saying, so it's, it's about just finding who you are as a person and, and mastering that, and trying to, I'm trying to, I'm trying to figure out how to be my best true self in 2022. Facts. <laughs> no, that's real. Self. That's like, beautiful. No cap, my best true self. Mm. Like, the best way, shape, or form. Like, even when it kind of like eventual future relationships, like, how can I be the best future self for somebody I'm going to deal with four years from now? Mm. Not now, but just like, Yeah, yeah in general. Yeah. Yeah. How can I be the best businessman, future mm. father, husband, son? Yeah, you got a vision, yo. Yeah, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Like, it ain't always about just, you know, work. I want to feel how I can be the best. Everything, friend, mm -hmm. father, son, all that shit in one. Yeah, Rome ain't built in a day. It just take yeah, time. Yeah, I know. That's that's yeah, that's I know. My, like my journey, just like you know, being around so much stuff, cause it can move so fast. Like for me, it was moving so fast, bro. Like every night, somebody new, like in that studio, and it was moving so fast to put. I ain't never had a chance to really like fully embrace it and just yeah. like mm -hmm. soak this shit in. Like damn, I really made it this far. Like it took me one time. I think it was in like. At my birthday, I, I, I go through, it was one night, man, I, I, I was pissy. I can say I'm drunk on here. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know I drink. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I got drunk on that. I'm going to be honest. And the night that I got drunk, I just was, like, reflecting on my whole life. I'm going through my art robbing shit. And I'm like, yo, like, <laughs> I'm looking at that shit from 2019, 2020. I almost cried. I'm like, yo, like, yeah. got to this point. Like, there's some shit that yeah. you can't even, like, can't you really got to, like, understand where I come from and mm -hmm. really understand, like, where I am now. Like, like, my two cousins, I was taking pictures of them in my apartment, stuck on bullshit. It was posting like I was made it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, for real. That's love. Bullshit. That's yeah. real love, though. Ain't really like no fake. Yeah. You lit now, I'm coming around, it's like real love. And that's the shit I feel like I get back in tune with um, 110%. So, yeah. I know that's right. Speaking of being in tune, we'll get right back to being in tune with this conversation right after this. Okay, okay. 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 Popping shit. Gotta get it. Uh, niggas out here hating, but ain't stopping shit. Uh, stop procrastinating, wasting time and shit. Uh, niggas only gangster when they signing in. Uh, hold on, baby, I can't hold on. Uh, so long, baby, I can't All right, go. so we gonna circle back, basically, to you talking about these relationships and these women and you wanting to be, you know, an upstanding man yeah. in, in your future. So, like, what's yeah. up? Like, what? What's going on with that? I don't know, man. Any special like, woman? No? I, uh, honestly, I had, like, one real relationship where I feel like somebody, like, really, like, pushed me and he was a good person. That was, like, my last relationship. I still had, like, no bad blood with that person. Mm -hmm. I still love her a lot, and I still wish, you know, wish her to be very successful in life. But sometimes things happen at the wrong time. Mm -hmm. so it just wasn't really meant to be at this time. But mm -hmm. she's still going to be, like, great in life, even if she's not with me. She was somebody else. I feel I still feel like 100 do amazing things. So, mm -hmm. but just women in general, man, it's like I don't know, like y'all weird. Like, <laughs> I don't know. Y'all weird, like I don't. I feel so like what's I, weird? Define define weird for me. I feel like as a man, like you know, you should you should have a woman. I feel like in this day and age, like to, for me in it, in in general, like I, I deal with so many women who just always ask for something. Um, give me a Chanel, give me a, a bus oh, down, give see, me a, I see what you mean. Back. And it's like, yo, yeah. like, like, how about you teach me something? How about you marriage me? You know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? Just um, stimulate my mind, teach me something that yeah. I really don't know. Like, 
Read the Bible to me. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> Sorry. Yeah. 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 Pray with me. Yeah, like, tell me how can you get your business to this next level? Because mm-hmm. I'm going to always be real with you. I'm going to tell you, like, yeah, get on your shit. Like, start a business. Like, do some shit where it's like, you really can level that shit up. Because I, I, I know, like, the person I want to be with, she got to be a hustler. Mm-hmm. I ain't tripping on nobody at all. Facts. Yeah. Facts. You could get, you could get, like, I could, like, uh, award you here and there. Like, a little, like, all right, yeah, this, this, I appreciate you. Mm-hmm. But I ain't tricking on Did you say like, award? Yeah, like sometimes like when y'all oh, she's a dog. She a dog. I don't I like that. Term. No, I, I, I give no, I get what you're saying. It's like when you get in a relationship, it's gonna be give and take, and that person will be equal. But you're not gonna. I'm not gonna award you like. No, you know what I'm I think I think it came off wrong. Like, but no, is award the right word? Is what I'm saying. Like, um, award in that context. That <laughs> taking it wrong for but her. you get what I'm saying. Like I feel like most people be like award. Like am I a pet? Like. Man, I'm around so many like different females, and and you know, the, I guess the industry that I'm in is just yeah. like very um. I it's an imbalance. Real, yeah, materialistic driven. You yeah. know what I'm saying? That's, that's some shit I just can't really yeah. like. Like, it's, it's, I'm gonna be real. I'm a cameraman in the industry, so sometimes this girl that might walk in and be like, "Am hey, I these top tier chicks? Like, mm-hmm. blue check chicks?" So it's understandable. The yeah, it's mm-hmm. understandable. He might look at me like, "All right, he's just a cameraman." It's something that might be like, "Oh, he handsome." Like. I might fuck with him, but it's something that's just like, no, I'm going for the big fish. Mm. It's cool. But for me, it just motivates me to understand, like, all right, two years from now, I'm going to be like, cool, you know, some shit yeah. like that. Yeah. That's some crazy shit, and I know it's going to happen, but they don't know that. It's yeah. cool. It's okay. But I just use that to motivate me and help me understand, like, this is not what I'm aiming to look for. This is not what I want in a female, like, at all. So yeah. I'm kind of really having that balance of, like, I know what I want versus what I don't want. Like, right. I've seen chicks come in the studio sometimes, like, no bullshit. They nigga probably might have them in the bus down watch, mm-hmm. uh, bus Cuban, yeah. Hermes, uh, Birkenbag, all types of stuff, and you still living wrong, mm-hmm. just doing shit behind his back just to be seen. Just to be, be you know, seen. Like, I, I seen it with my eyes, so that's t- that's the type of shit that be hurting my heart. Like, damn, like you got a nigga doing all this, and all you this still for you. Still be around him. Some more rich niggas. Like, yeah, <laughs> that shit don't even add up. So that's when I was like, nah, I need a girl with substance. I need a girl that's gonna love me. For me, whether I'm up, whether I'm down, like, I'm at the point, I don't even want to tell no girl what I do. You, you just gonna have to know I'm a cameraman, uh-huh. you take it or you don't, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. No, look, see, yep, exactly. Yeah, for real, like, it's that type of, it's that type of serious with me at this point. Um, So, so give me a, uh, Except, uh, yeah, about to say, yeah, you yeah. get it to him. Except blue checks, give me some blue checks there. I ain't trying to name drop. You don't got name But dropping. I'm saying, give me like a story like, with like, the blue give check. Give us a little story, check, like something for, like, that happened. He was like, no, I, I seen what with Cho the other day, but now you with him. I'm going to be real. One time, um, I ain't going to say the odds, man. <laughs> please yeah. don't. Yeah. yeah. Please, please don't. don't. Shit, try to go wild. You're trying to be bad. <laughs> nah, it ain't, it ain't, it's not, it's, it's, it's not nobody that I work with. Yeah. Uh, nobody on the dream chase a Let me act clear. Nobody on the dream chase a family. But one time somebody walked in the studio. And he 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 definitely hot, man. He he walked in the studio. It just happened to be like three females on the couch. One happened to be with her nigga. Like, you know, sometimes niggas Dang. like to bring Like the family. nigga was in there with her? Yeah, you know, sometimes <laughs> dudes, dudes just like to bring their girl in the studio just to like catch a walk. Yeah, this yeah. is why I be around. That's some weird shit. I would never do that, but I guess that's how you know if your girl really fucking with you. But long story short, <laughs> for him it was a bad day because a big fish walked in the room. A super big fish. A big fish. Yeah, a super big fish walked in the room. That was the first time where I'm like, I'm looking at these girls' reaction. I'm like, well, yeah, I want us to me, he ain't he cool to me, but like to to them girls, like they probably like, what the fuck? So yeah. I'm, I'm looking at their reactions. I'm looking at his girl. I'm like, and he looking at his girl too. <laughs> and I see all three eyes as soon as he walked in the room go like this. I'm like, oh, yeah, yeah. It's old. It's old. He mm. looked at her like, he looked at her. I know his heart was like, crushed. Yeah, yeah, like. I'm talking about she bust down, cube and all that. I'm like, damn. Like, she around with a big fish. Yeah, I'm like, and, and, and they left. They start arguing or some shit. I'm like, damn. Like, but that's the line you right there. Like, <laughs> this shit evil world. You know what I mean? It's just about, like, you, you really need a girl who's really not into, like, that, that, that status symbol shit and just like that that whole vibe of like you know what's what's hot like I yeah. I'm I'm so like I ain't really into that like I'll be around what's hot every day I don't even act like you can see me on the street you yeah. no type shit like I'm just cool but I'm really in some shit so I want my girl to be like mm-hmm. the same 
can't be like all that creepy shit. I don't even care. We were running some rock with bomb. Like, just act normal, man. You want that star So, now, I might, I might go off for of Michelle because, you know, yeah, that's my girl. Yeah, real Beyonce. It's real yeah. cool shit. Like, you don't got really, like, oh, my God. Like, yeah, I don't no. even want nobody around me like that. Like, mm-hmm. so, so, then how is it that you go about, like, meeting women? Right now, or how has dating been this yeah. whole time? Right like, now, in general? I ain't gonna lie, like, uh, I, I got out of my relationship probably like the end of 20, no, no, the, excuse me, the beginning of 2021 before I got signed. So that's when I got out of it. And once I got signed, man, I just was freestyling. I ain't gonna lie, like, mm-hmm. traveling the world safely, of course, but like, I'm freestyling. Just, just like, doing meeting, your thing. Yeah, meeting different people, different yeah. women from different countries. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you just, just you're experiencing. Yeah. That's I ain't gonna hold no shit like that, but you know, I'm 22. <laughs> I mean, you yeah. bro. Yeah, I'm happy. Yeah. Yeah. I know that's right. Come yeah. on. I mean, you yeah. gotta do what you gotta do. Yeah, you still having, learn. I be, I be having fun. I be smart too. Like I don't just touch anybody. Like, I'm real particular. Nah, I don't like, just I touch anybody. Like like, I mean, yeah. you shouldn't. No, yeah, no, no, no. It was how he said <laughs> you it. Ain't like, no you ain't got no tight. You ain't got no tight. I mean, I don't know. I, 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 like, like my last girlfriend was Blazing. Gotcha. Like, okay. Blazing and black, so she's right. just, that's she, a cheat code. Yeah, so she's like light skin. I guess, I guess I got like tight for like light skin. Like, I ain't saying I'm bougie when it comes to women, but like, you, you gotta have some type of substance or like, I ain't just touching anybody. Like, maybe the younger me, mm-hmm. maybe like, I was like, you be just, picking and choosing when you want yeah, to. Yeah, now I'm like super particular about like, am I even gonna get it? Because girls can easily manipulate situations. Like, girl, he asked him my number, bro. He like, is it that deep? Like, it's yeah. just like they try to manipulate situations. Mm-hmm. Like, girl, he was just in my DM, like, just a little weird yeah. shit. Just yeah. like, just because you can see, like, oh, yeah, he was. They can say they had access to you. Yeah, basically. you get what I'm saying? So now I'd be, like, real particular on just the mm-hmm. type of person you as your character. And, yeah. I, and I don't deal with any women in Baltimore, so it's not no girl in Baltimore that can really see they yeah. had me. I did X, Y, Z mm-hmm. for them. Like, if I did talk to you, it's probably, like, yeah. so sort of quick, easy, done. I'm not saying like that, but it's nothing. <laughs> no, I mean, yeah. I get it. It's, it's, I feel like Baltimore, like, I hate to say it, it's either one way or the other. Like, you either have a girl who's like super, like, humble, and not humble, like, you don't believe in yourself, but humble in the sense where, like, like girls you head, chill. I feel like girls' head, man. Honestly, me and my cousin talk about it all the time. Like, they, they be thinking like they more than. What is it? Yeah, yeah. Like, I, I, like, yo, I'm 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 I hate this. It's true. I go to New York, it'd be girls that be 10 times better. Uh-huh. Good shit, old conversations. Like, can really hold a conversation. I ain't trying to talk to you. You ain't trying to talk to me. It's love. Like, mm-hmm. we basically networking for it. You're just pretty as shit. Yeah. Like, it could yeah. be a girl head, really bullshit. And it's like, and she thinks she and carry, she thinks she level ten or something. Yeah, like whole time shop, she level you seven. You on the shop? That's what's up. Yeah. Cool, cool beans. Yeah. That's, that's you good. said cool beans. Why is it a thing yeah, though? Like, well, like, I don't know, it's I'm real, not from right? Baltimore, so I, I I just always oh, hear. Um, it's like that celebrity. Yeah, like that celebrity. That's that that Baltimore celebrity mm-hmm. mindset. mindset. I really hate right. that shit because yeah, it's yeah, like shit, especially because yeah. because Baltimore's so small. So if you yeah. even have any type of like everybody, knows you know, clout in the city. It's like you feel like you're here. Like, 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 like a lot of people to like that shit to them. And that was, mm-hmm. that was when I really knew, man. Like I dropped my, my CV shirts and shit. Mm-hmm. I'm getting orders from like Nigeria. Mm-hmm. But I get orders from cousins. Well, we did. My cousin helped me pack this shit. So yeah, Toronto, Toronto, that's what's yeah. Shit yeah. From really all over yeah, the world. And that's when I knew, like my shit global was bigger than Baltimore. Yeah. I don't even care. Like. I'm a Baltimore celebrity, or if you know me, you know me, that's cool, it's love. Mm-hmm. I ain't really have my chest on and shit, yeah. like, yeah. treat people differently. You're humble, that's it. Yeah, like, I feel like sometimes chicks got that, like, mindset. Like, I'm a, I'm, some people just ain't raised right, too. Like, yeah. that's just so what it is. I'm being serious, like. You raised right? I, I definitely, because uh, cause a lot of things, like, you know, when it comes to that type I'm, of I'm stuff. I'm getting messy for it, so I ain't going to hold you get what? I'm getting messy. I'm saying, I was just asking you a question. But I'm, when I, when I, when I, when I seriously though, I feel like at like 25, maybe 26, I feel like I'm settled down. Really, yeah, I want to get somebody. I ain't, I mean, you never know. God, God might have something like in store for me, like even before then. But like, that's at the age where I feel like, man, I really just want to build some shit up. Like, yeah. I know what I got and stuff. Mm-hmm. But I want to make sure she is like, I don't know. My soulmate might be in New York. I ain't gonna lie. Maybe. Might I'm talking be. about New York. Here to talk, tell you at 25. <laughs> I know, I was thinking that too, like, listen, because... Yeah. I mean, you you might have better luck, though, because, not to be rude, but, like, there, it's, it turns it turns to be more quality women than there are quality men, mm-hmm. so you probably might meet your, uh, your soul man from the 25, yeah. but I'm going to tell you, don't count on it. Yeah. 
Yeah. Don't count on That's what I'm saying. It's hard for me to really count. Yeah. So at least had that person with it, though, like, we could, yeah. even if we ain't together, like, I got that type of bond with yeah. it, like, later down the line, we gonna build some shit up. I wanna build, like, a dynasty with a yeah. chick. I don't wanna just have, like, hella baby mothers. I wanna build, like, a few businesses where, like, she laying on me, I'm laying yeah. on her. Yeah. She know what I got going yeah. on. She do she her thing, around. you do her thing. I'm yeah. coming together. Bring you around when I'm around yeah. and yeah. still the same person. Right. Like, you don't let that shit get to your head. Right. I'm scared. I bring certain yeah. girls around, certain shit, their head just gonna get. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. you gotta find somebody that's like equally yoked. And, like yeah. that's really what it is, and and it's it, I'm sure for you it kind of sucks because in the first you know couple times hanging out with a girl, especially when you do bring her around stuff, yeah. you could probably tell off bat oh, like right. dad, like no. Girl, it's only three. It's only two of my cousins so far that I just even bring around the shit that I'm in. Mm-hmm. Right? Mm-hmm. Probably my other cousin Tay, I would have brought him around it, of course, but. It's not too many people after that that was just bringing that mm-hmm. lifestyle. Cause yeah. These are the people that I know if they get in them room, they're going to chill out. They're going to chill. Gonna be cool. Like, yeah. Yeah, you know what oh, I'm, I'm hip. I, I had to learn that the yeah. hall when it was in Vegas. I, yeah. I, 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 I brought my homeboy up. I ain't going to tell the story again. Everybody yeah. not ready for that. Yeah. Yeah. Everybody yeah. not ready for that. And it's, yeah. it's, 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 it's a high level. Yeah. Like, it's it a is. high level. Like, Starstruck. Yeah, like he was around some heavy shit off of one day. So it's like, you get what I'm saying? But mm-hmm. he just kept us cool the whole time. Niggas fuck with him. Let me do some of these things. Let me do some yeah, yeah. Sure. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Like, but it's like we just got some chill shit. So mm-hmm. I'm the type of people I like to have around me. Just chill. That shit hard, man. I'm I'm gonna get a little messy, y'all. Yeah. I'm a girl. <laughs> Yo, you be sliding in the DMs, y'all? No, I be sliding in the DMs. Yeah. Uh, depends. <laughs> it took you too long to answer, so that's a yeah. Depends. I, I ain't gonna lie to you. Lately, I've been sliding in like a lot of Philly girls' DMs. That be like, Philly? Yeah, I like okay. Philly girls. Yeah, I mean, they cut. We cousins, though. Yeah, look, right there. Philly girls, cool. I like their style too. Mm-hmm. I ain't been, I ain't been too crazy. How about like LA man. girls though? I feel like LA. They look weird though. LA girls. Yeah, they, they look weird though. I, 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 I ain't gonna lie, I got girls all over the country. <laughs> no bullshit. <laughs> like whenever I go on AC, like I got girls. <laughs> <man. She's laughs> <like, laughs> <like, laughs> It got to that point. Like, when I go to Miami, yeah. I like a Miami girl. I go to LA, I like a little. So, LA you got, girl. so you basically saying you got a joint every, every, every couple. These are my friends. Like, friends. like friends. Yeah. <laughs> hey, yo. <laughs> not, you, not you sitting there so like, like the friends. meme of that fox. <laughs> These are really my friends. Like, you can't have friends. No, but you yeah, can. You can, you can, can, you can do whatever you want. All over the country. You can do whatever you, you want. Whatever you build a relationship right there. Whatever. You networking. You can live whatever you want, how you want. Yeah, that's why, like, when I'm in Baltimore, girls be thinking, like, if really want some shit, I just be like, okay. <laughs> you can no, it. Not okay. You no, got yeah. it. Yeah, yeah. yeah, you got the time. Put the energy in there. Yeah. So you ain't gonna really tell us the story how you slide and you got denied or something? Or you slide? I'm no, sorry. That depends, man. Like, like for now, I, I really don't do it a lot. Like, it, it might be like a little. Like the story vibe, or you know, oh yeah, cause they That's got the little cool. heart now. Yeah, on the it'd story. be hard for it'd be hard for me just sliding girls. To be honest, could be like the girls that that be following me. They be having so many followers to the point where it's like I know, like if even if I do try to talk to you, you got hella mm-hmm. niggas probably trying. What? That's not your concern. It really ain't, but I don't got time. That's a lot to deal with. Competition. Like, rather, That's not like, competition. You should only be worried about yourself. Like, not even that. So not even that. I'd rather my chick like she posts a lot about her business or. So, you know, a little selfie in there, like some attraction. chill shit. Yeah. yeah, like, if you more concerned about you posting the picture you have naked mm-hmm. every other day, like, clearly, you ain't really, you looking for somebody to see, like, you mm-hmm. fire for real. I want somebody who really ain't into you. Nobody fire. Like, you know yeah. you fire, but you'll rather post some shit about your business or what you try to promote, what you doing. Like, that yeah. shit is more like the shit that's I'm into. Like, it's, it's, it's a lot of shit that, that attract me as far as, like, a fat ass, big shit, <laughs> and, like, keep it. That's cool, right? But how many girls can really like attract your mind? Like you get what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. like I ain't really had a girl really challenge me yet. Like on some like maybe so maybe what my type of ex, challenge like, are you looking for? Hey, cause help me out here. Like, <laughs> help, me, help me out, yo. Just saying, like teach you something. Yeah. Like, give some knowledge to you something. I should have had but more. I guess time. I guess. I guess that before, so. No, and I think that's to- I think that's totally respectable. But I'm gonna have to ask the question of because. Of who you are, who you've been around, who you done this and this with, like yo, your mindset might be here mm-hmm. for real. Like, do you really think that there's a woman that you might or you can really come in contact with or encounter that's gonna be at the level of all these like big, big mm-hmm. names that you? That's why I keep saying you really like your mind. Like, that's the thing. Like, I don't, it don't even gotta be somebody who got the name as me. As long as you just like a humble, down to earth person and you ain't really like. I ain't saying you ain't impressed by it, but you respect it. You don't gotta be impressed as long as you respect, respect it. You get what I'm yeah. saying? Yeah. And, and understand what it took me to get here. 
Yeah. Um, I can I can fuck with that. Like you can build it together. Like I bring you around certain shit. Like I, I just can't take anybody to rock me some brunch. Like yeah, no, like, <laughs> not at all. <laughs> I mean that's different though. You can't take a bunch. Yeah, like, like JJ, like, like, you know like, 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 somebody shit. I really feel like um you, for one you ain't I got to feel like you ain't using me because you could easily. Leave me at the party, go find a big fish somewhere, just walking around, yeah, just go around, leave yeah. me around. Like, I'm gonna be like, well, damn, like, you get what I'm saying? Like, yeah. you got somebody that really fuck with me. You gotta move strategically, like what you're saying. You just gotta, you just gotta, like you said, you go back to what you were saying. You just particular what you what you want. Yeah. You gotta, you gotta, yeah. you gotta do your homework. Yeah. Yeah. Somebody that's secure. When I was younger, when I, was younger I really wasn't that in tune to, like, you know, what I, what I really like. And I was just young, man, high school. I'm just like, I should keep whatever going. You having fun. Like, you don't really know what yeah. you're you young. That shit don't really matter. Like, I don't even think, I don't even think I was in no relationship in high school. I don't know nobody in high school I even dealt with for real. So, um, yeah. <laughs> That's I how you know you've been around people. Yeah, I don't remember nobody in high school I dealt with, honestly. That's, that's um, how you know you My last relationship, probably, like, my own, like, real relationship. Was that, was that, and that was the 2020 relationship? 2020, yeah. Got you. Yeah. Okay. She told me a lot, for sure. How long y'all was never? How long, how long y'all was go? Like a year. A year. Oh, Once I got signed, it was like, I was gone. She moved to Atlanta, so. So the distance was hard? Yeah, I, I really couldn't. Then, like, with, with my anxiety and shit, when I, with my work, and then her yelling and shit, I can't. So let's get it so But maybe y'all could like you know, maybe like through her growth and your growth right, y'all can like that's, meet. That's yeah, for sure. That's, yeah. like, that's, that's always gonna be my dub, but right now no, that's old. Really that's old right? yeah. <laughs> <What>? <laughs> It is no, not no, no, it, might, it might be, but, that's but old, it right. might be, but I train my mind I train my mind to be like I ain't one of them guys that's like real possessive like I ain't I ain't I'm not that guy no, Cause no you more. comfortable within yourself. Yeah, right? like if she decided, you know, mess with dude, you could be richer than me, you could be uh, uh, NBA player, but NFL player, whatever mm-hmm. case may be. If that's what she chooses to do, I wish for the best. And you know, I hope she had me, for sure. That's so, the type of mindset I got. If you could advertise yourself right now for all the ladies that's watching, yeah. what would you say to them? Like, y'all, this me, humble, blah, blah. Like, I don't know. Go well, ahead, I feel audition. Like, I, feel like, I feel like you're going to come from my own shit, though. Like, I don't know. Like, I feel like my first dates with girls, like, I automatically just be myself. Like, you're going to catch my vibe of who I am mm-hmm. and what you expect. I'm always be honest with you, tell you my intentions. So what's what's like? Cause since you did call us weird earlier, <laughs> what's what's the biggest thing that like not like when you were around others, but like you in the comfort of maybe your space or y'all on a date? What was like one of the weirdest things like a girl ever did, and you automatically knew at that moment you was like, nope, never taking shorty out ever again. Mm. It could have had one of the moments, cuz. Oh, no. Yeah, that's tough. <laughs> I don't know. Like, it was recently a girl did some, like, weird shit. Um, when I was with Dre, it was a bit recent. But, um, I don't know. That's a good one, bro. That's why I was asking, because you wow, called this like, weird, so I'm like, Give me a crazy right. moment you had with a chick, though. Yeah. Crazy, crazy moment? Crazy moment. Like, she just, like, Jasmine Sullivan bust one out the car. Oh, oh, shit. Oh, oh, no. No. Oh, and I know I heard all them laugh, so I'm like, all right. They've been there, they see me. I ain't gonna lie, big dog. See me, I ain't gonna lie. It was, oh shit, it was a crazy, it was a crazy night one night, man. With my ah, it cuz I even said this shit on camera. I don't know. Yeah, I was just saying that somebody one night they decided to spray paint my shit. Oh dang. Bust my uh, tires out. It was a wild mess, man. Like it was. And a, where was this located? Like, was it here? In Baltimore. This was oh. before I got signed. This Damn. probably like I think this was probably like before my twenty first, before my twenty first birthday. Damn. This was December. Damn. So. Sure, it was mad. So, so it was it was crazy shit, man. Like I, I'm thinking like I'm some, like I ain't gonna. If she see the shit, man, it's it's a true story. Like I, I ain't. You ain't name shit. dropping, so yeah. we don't know. Like I, I feel like I wasn't gonna make it that night. It was a crazy <laughs> night. Like I, was, I could have died that night. So. Oh dang! I, I, it was I, that I, I locked, sick. It was crazy. I locked myself in my car, and I had to call him. I called, I called T. I was like, How Yo, you lock come. yourself in your car. She outside. <laughs> oh. <laughs> He was trying to be safe. I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'm thinking you be, maybe no, walked I, I, up I on the car, saying, saw man. everything. I know, I know what you were saying. You oh. was like, call my cousin, call my cousin. He, uh, I'm like, yo, come get me right now. My Photo? dude with East Baltimore, we all way in the county. He drive all the way to fucking where he at. She start looking away. I straight got the car. Boom, slam the door. Run to, run to his truck. <laughs> He opened the door. He's like, get in. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he ran that Wait, so you couldn't, 
Like, no, he you know, my tires. Oh, my tires. oh yeah, the tires. Hey, I'm trying to he, 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 no, he had nowhere to go. Like, <laughs> That's why I'm like, why are you saying peel off on it? Like, yeah, no, he, he tried to peel off. He yeah, would have yeah, cut, cut two. Yeah, he was trying. Cause, cause, oh, my God. Like, man, Grab the bottle, yo. Oh, man. She screwed up. My hand bleeding and shit. Oh, damn. Wow. Shit, man. It, was a, it, was a, it was a ride of silence, man. What you do? A ride of silence. We didn't have that bitch listening to J. Cole. Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> Kevin, Kevin's heart. She oh. Like, oh my gosh. <laughs> hey, yo. Hey, Cole, we was listening to Kevin's heart. Oh, oh boy, she didn't have to listen to Kevin's heart. Silence. Oh <laughs> my gosh. You was talk. probably trying to, like, decompress from yeah, everything. I'm, you must have really been her ass. I'm embarrassed, I'm embarrassed bro. I'm like, cause, No, man. that's definitely a lot. Wow. Come on, just leave that car there. It's done. Done. It's done. Bro, done. I got it fixed like the next day, but it was. I, I be look. It is gone now. I only got that car no more, but it's um. Yeah, I, be, I used to look at it like it's traumatized. Yeah, I used to look at it and be like, damn, we got a little scratch on it from that. I used to just, I don't want to try this. Yeah, <laughs> look, like, yeah, just yeah, yeah, yeah give it away. Yeah, it's traumatized. I used to look at the car like, yeah. damn. And I was I was 21 when that happened, so that was the that was like the icing on the cake for. No, I was 20. Excuse me, I was 20 when that happened. I was about to turn 21, so that was the icing on the cake for like. Yo, I'm too young to be dealing with this yeah, shit. Like, yeah, hell yeah. Like too much. Like, you were very young. Yeah, I'm like, it's too much. It's too much. Yeah. Especially, like, y'all don't, don't have no real attachments. I mean, nobody yeah, should be doing that regardless. Know, but yeah, no kids. I kind of want to know what she do. Like, what, 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 how she get to that point with all that rage? Like, She went through my phone. Got you. <laughs> That's what I mean. Well, on that note, um, before we wrap up. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? Look. Yeah, like that's do the fuck though. That's, that's yeah. funny. Before um, you wrap up, well, I'm not crazy though. I wasn't mm-hmm. nothing for her to be that though. She know. was yeah, just I mean, wild. Exactly it was it, but that's yeah. still that's just out of pocket. Honestly. Yeah, yeah. yeah. She yeah. might see this video and be like, "Yo, so you really out here doing this it, to be right now?" Yeah. 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 I know, right? Good thing you don't live here. She, she might do. He be saying when she talk to me, she might do. Mm. There's something about that Taji shit. I still love. Oh my god, shit crazy, right? Don't sound like bug. Don't sound like bug. 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 Love that Taji. Still love. Love that Taji. You wanna call? Exactly. And you, like toxic, and you like toxic energy. I didn't say I like it, but. You no, gotta you say you had a, a little attachment. You gotta have a little bit of toxic though. Little Sweetheart, little go to therapy. No, man. No, sir. <laughs> well, a, little, a little excitement. Yeah, a little excitement. Okay, I see, what, I see what you mean. I mean, you were said the terrorist. She's the same way though. Like I said. She's she, she the same way. I ain't saying she, 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 she loves toxic, 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 toxic disaster yeah. energy. She loves it. I'm not saying she's 100% toxic. The woman was too stunned to speak. I'm saying, though, like, if I'm fresh as shit, I'm ready to go out. She'd be like, well, who you going up with? Have a little bit. I got you. I got you. She was like, no, she was like, no. Let's not toxic. Yeah. Let's not toxic. 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 Let's not I'm gonna choke up, like, yo, where you going? 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 See, I ain't gonna lie, that thing low. See, that shit, 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 that Got you, got you. But mostly Sony. So I mean, I've heard Sony. Yeah. Great. If you got, if you got any advice you want to give to the young people that want to see. Yeah. You, right? man, uh, believe in your dreams, man, and, and understand that anything is possible. Because two years ago, man, I, I didn't think I would be where I am today. Um, I just always had the vision, and a plan, and I manifested. So if you can man, manifest, look at interviews, look at the people you want to surround yourself with, and be like, I can be there two years mm-hmm. from now. And, just have good people around you that really believe in what you're trying to do, and right. like what you, you know, what you really want to achieve, and and keep pushing yourself, man. Like you gotta be consistent. That's the that's the thing I feel like with telling like consistency. If you lose or if people try to see you lose, keep going, and proving wrong. Use that right. motivation. Like, right. ain't don't ever let nobody tell you something you can't do. You just gotta keep pushing forward and trying to be like the best you. That's the right. thing. That's what's true, man. Drop your IG for the people to know the fire. Yeah, uh, my IG uh, Carter's underscore vision. And uh, YouTube called his vision, and my regular page called his show. Yeah, and I um, got the merch on sale, shit like that, man, too. Grab a shit, $20. <laughs> Bet. Where they grab a shirt at? Instagram? Nah, they're in the trunk. I got a few in the trunk. Like, yeah, some other meetings and shit. Yeah, we grab a couple while you're out of there. I'm gonna get one. Like that. Let's go. All right, but well, no, this was great. Yeah, Thank you for, you for coming yeah, on the show. Always. This is dope for sure. Yeah. Appreciate you, man. Yeah, y'all gonna have some heavy people watching this. 
Yeah. Hey. That's all That's we need. Yeah. I know. I know. All right. Well, well we out. See y'all. I just wanna spend my life with you all day You say that you love me, is it true? You say I'm the only one that's all for you Okay, make me feel away, make me feel away Shorty so damn dangerous, fuck me like I'm famous, yeah I've been so impatient, so glad that you made it here Took my dick and faced it, shorty going crazy, yeah Thought that you was playing, told me spray it everywhere She want me to take it, take it, what you tryna do? Shorty said